what's going on guys, Smear here, back with another video of episode number 2 of Building Cars Season 2. Um, so today, I'm thinking of building, I don't know, something sleeper. I want to build a sleeper car. Um, I'm thinking maybe, what the hell is that front camber doing? As you see, as you saw in episode 1, I built a 180, which was a great drift car. Um, now... This is insane. Forza Specials, modern SUV. This doesn't count as a sleeper, like it's insane, but I need a sleeper car. Sleeper cars, so if you don't know what sleeper, a sleeper car means, um, it means that something that you won't expect to be fast. So it's gonna be like insanely cool and fast. It doesn't have to look cool though. Like it can have a rusty paint job for instance, but still go like a rocket. I'm thinking, of an S60 Polestar, but everyone knows it's actually quite fast. Uh -huh. <clears throat> uh, 242, maybe a 123 GT. Oh, that's cool. Uh, maybe an old Volkswagen Mark uh, Beetle. I know Beetles can be insane. Um, no Toyotas. What? Are you kidding me? Wait a second. I need to check something. This keeps on happening with. I'm thinking of getting it like an Evo, maybe. Who knows? Acura Alfa Romeo. No, I can drive that. Good. Um, thinking. I'm still. I'm very, very cute. Like, I don't know what to build when it comes to sleeper. Even though that that's something, but I want something that will start off a bit fast. The Trackhawk. It looks just like the normal Grand Cherokee, even though the Grand Cherokee is insane. Um, thinking, I'm, I'm, damn it, sucks. Um, am I gonna do sleeper car? XR2? Or maybe a Capri, that Capri. Nah, XR2 is better, I'll make it all wheel drive, a rear wheel drive, no. XR2 it is 20 grand, cheap, that's good, um, um, I'm gonna get it. I like this. I like this black. Uh, buy, buy with the homologation parts just so we can get it for cheaper. So I have 124,000, I think. I'm not that 100, 104,000. So I think we're gonna go upgrade this thing maybe until I'm broke or something. Um, what? Why? It has body mods. Oh, hell, I like that. It removes the bumper, it kind of makes it look better, to be fair, uh, it kind of makes it look, yeah, I don't like that wing, not, neither that, so I'm gonna take it off. Uh, we can go no bumper, or tiny bumper, I'm thinking of no bumper, because I, I want to make it look standard mud flaps, nah, I know this, this, this thing did rally, oh, oh my god. That looks so sick. Like, no matter what they say, that looks sick. Engine swap. I could put a two liter inline four or a turbo rally. Now the inline four is a bit better, it's a bit cheaper than the turbo rally, yeah. So I'm gonna make it rear wheel drive, a bit lighter. I want, I want this thing to be light. Uh, I think I'm gonna put a turbo, I like a small turbo. Um, body mods are done. I'm not gonna touch anything with this. Oh, okay, actually. Are there wheels that I would like to change? I might, maybe the turbo fans, or maybe uh, these. That kind of makes it look racy. Ah, oh, God. I want to change the wheels. Since it is a sleeper car, uh, this you won't expect this to be fast. You just expect it. Yeah, kind of looks like a Golf, a uh, Mark One Golf, if you ask me. Oh, easy, easy peasy, easy squeezy. Definitely these uh, rotiforms. Now I'm a, I'm a, I'm a sucker for these rotiforms. They're just insane. Uh. That looks good. 
So I'm gonna lift it up. Like, I'm gonna give it a suspension upgrade, but then I'm gonna lift it up back up again. I'm gonna make it even lighter. So, like, it's gonna be insane. Um, like, the interior will stay the same, everything will stay the same, except for the power. Like, that looks good. If you disagree, like, I don't know what, I don't know where you come from. But the turbo will help because I don't want it to be too powerful, but I don't want it uh, to be uh, too, like, underpowered. So, ooh, I think I'm gonna stay in A class. Yeah. It's a sleeper. It needs to be fed. You know what? Let's go to S class. Come on. We can do it. I have money. Woohoo! Um, we need to max out the gear ratios and everything. Um, put more power and then I'll go to the gears and then I'll fix the tires I'll make the I'll give them some nice race tires this thing s class very light very powerful I'm a bit afraid I think I'm gonna toss on all-wheel drive I think because it might just spin its wheels for days that's maxed out um drag tire yeah let's let's put drag tires on a on a sleeper car uh, what? Excuse me, why would I put 17s on a car that comes 13s? Uh, thinking about tossing all-wheel drive. I'm not happy about it. Or I can get rid of the turbo. No, yeah, I'm gonna get rid of the... No, I want the turbo though. So this is like a new Fiesta. This is a Fiesta. It's a new Fiesta. It's a new uh, day Fiesta. But... So it's an old Fiesta modernized to the new Focus or Fiesta whatever um this is a fiesta xr2 it's all-wheel drive now uh it's turboed it's light it's powerful very powerful actually uh diff everything with t i have 20 grand left i'm thinking about keeping those wheels stock again i'm a bit afraid about it. yeah that looks super nice and the front bumper i kind of want to keep for the yeah yeah, like you look at this car, you'd expect oh may maybe some reliability mods, not much. Um, so we can go now, and we're we're gonna test it out. We'll do a quick race around test track. That'll be good. Um, why drift? Uh, custom Mac drive tires, three laps of this. Let's go. Um, so this is the XR2. It's a very cool sleeper car. Um, and hopefully you are liking the season, season 2 in Forza Motorsport 7, not in Horizon 3. Uh, I know some people don't like Forza Motorsport 7 because of some of its mistakes. All game has its flaws. Like, no game is perfect unless you're playing Minecraft or something. Um, I don't think Minecraft is perfect. You know what? Race setup. I'm gonna make it two laps. Come on, game! This game never wants to load for some reason. And I'm starting to get a bit worried. Uh, come on, track. Load. Load. Track. Come on, track. <sighs> this is very annoying sometimes, and I don't want to cut the video. Okay, finally. Now I can start my race at test track. So it's all-wheel drive, it's it's a cool car, like black, the black with the wheels and everything. That sounds stock. Since when is that in the game? Yo, it's sleeper car versus supercar I'm guessing. Okay, I've made a mistake. But wait, 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 I saw something. New hidden car. I think it's in last. Ni number 92 Porsche RSR, and I'm not allowing, and I'm not, I didn't, oh. The person I'm trying to replicate, over there. Oh, a little trick for um, this track. The thing has a bit of understeer, but like, especially on this track, where it's all high-speed corners. Um, I should have kept it rear-wheel drive. 
Um, let me continue quickly. This thing isn't as successful, but I like it. It's a good drift car. Okay, I should be dead by now. I'm driving on the hardest. If, like, this is another secret route for the test track. See, I, I pass everyone. It's a good Gymkhana car. Should relabel it as Gymkhana. But that RSR is a hidden car. I think. I'm not 100% sure. Whoa! What? Look at that! And then I just saved it. All wheel drive for the win! No, it can't keep up. It, it can keep up with these guys. Like, look. The power difference. I'm just going. It just goes. Okay, I crashed on purpose there. Oh, it's so light, it actually took off. <laughs> it just took off. It was like, hey, how about this? We'll take off. Woo! I jumped over a Lambo. I jumped over a Lambo. This is not going to work anymore. This car is good. This car is a Gymkhana car. I should relabel it as Gymkhana. A Gymkhana sleeper. Yo, this is sick. And it stops as well. Woohoo! That's the end of the race. Yeah, I don't want to show any more because of my bad driving skills. Hey, and I'll see you guys in the next video. But before I end the video, um,. I really like this build, it was very fun. So it's a sleeper Gymkhana car, it just slides everywhere. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video for episode number three.